Ontario Liberal leader Bonnie Crombie has ruled out a provincial carbon tax if elected in 2026. The announcement comes after months of attack ads from the Ford government accusing Crombie of championing the policy when she was a federal Liberal MP. Let me be very clear. A carbon tax will not be part of my plan. That announcement putting the Ford government on the defensive after months of calling Bonnie Crombie the queen of the carbon tax. Bonnie Crombie has said she will not be imposing a provincial carbon tax, but she has fallen short. The Conservatives still accusing Crombie and the Liberals of supporting the federal carbon tax, with the price polluters have to pay to emit carbon set to increase by 23% on April 1st. You all should stand up and join us this morning as we call for Justin Trudeau and the federal Liberals to scrap. It's a call being echoed by political leaders and premiers across the country. This is something the NDP has been clear about from day one. The onus should not be on the individual, on the consumer. It should be on the big polluters. Though Crombie didn't directly address the unpopular federal policy in her announcement. I think it would be quite meaningful for Bonnie Crombie to actually take a position on the carbon tax that's making it impossible for people to pay their bills and they're having to choose between heating and eating in Ontario today. But it appears the provincial Liberals are, in fact, distancing themselves from their federal cousins. That would be a fair thing to say because we're not going to impose a carbon tax on families in our plan. It's that simple. The thing that's most important to people right now is being able to put food on the table, pay the rent, pay the mortgage, and that's what's on their mind. And you have to recognize that. Crombie wasn't at Queen's Park to answer questions and has only appeared once since the start of the new year. She made a pretty significant like a announcement today. Why isn't she here today? I know she'll be here tomorrow. The Trudeau government has said 80% of households will get more money back in rebates than they pay in carbon taxes. Families don't see that. They don't recognize that. In her announcement, Crombie adding she's put together a climate action panel to put together the Liberals' environmental platform ahead of the next provincial election. She says she will ensure major polluters pay. For City News, I'm Tina Yazdani.